friends welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new my name is Blair so I have a Aldi grocery haul for you guys um, I'm going to show you guys what we got from Aldi and then tomorrow we're going to be getting some things from Walmart and I'm just going to kind of combine um, both grocery hauls into one big grocery haul and excuse my voice today my throat is like <laughs> suffering <laughs> All right, guys, so my husband went shopping. So, of course, he got things that were not on my list. So, he got some vanilla ice cream sandwiches. He got two of these brie and apple stuffed chicken breasts for the girls to have for dinner one night. He got two boxes of these garlic knots to have with pasta. Avery wants to have um, spaghetti one night. He also got some of this beer-battered um, fish. I guess for the girls to have one night, he took Avery shopping with him and she's always picking out some stuff. <laughs> so um, that's for the girls to have for dinner one night. He also got some beef burgers. He got some hot Italian sausages. Um, we're having some people come over tomorrow after church and we're gonna let the kids play and stuff. So. Um, I'm gonna show you in a minute. He got some hot dogs, but he also got some sausages. So we got two packages of these organic beef hot dogs. We got some Irish butter. So this is not what I wanted, but he got the spreadable Irish butter. Um, it has canola oil in it. So that's not what I wanted, but he got that. And he also got the pure Irish butter. This is really what I wanted. Um, I'm going to get some more butter, the butter that I like, from Walmart. We got some plain non-fat Greek yogurt. We started using this instead of sour cream a while ago. So, um, we're gonna have tacos one night this week, or a couple nights. It actually lasts, like, three nights. So, yeah, um, whenever we have tacos, I like to get this for the kids and my husband. And then when I go to Walmart... I'll get the dairy-free yogurt, and that's what I use. The kids love to have guacamole with our tacos, so he got some of that. I told him that we didn't need any more chicken because we have a lot of chicken in the freezer still, but he thought that that was a good price for it, so we're going to portion it out, and yeah, I guess we'll just have more chicken. <laughs> we got four more of this organic grass-fed ground beef. I love this. Um, I'm trying to eat more red meat just to get um, more iron and stuff, and it's good for your hormone health. So, um, yeah, we got four of those. It's way cheaper at Aldi, so we like to kind of stock up when we go there. We got two packages of this chicken sausage. It's spinach and feta cheese, and this is so delicious. So, we got two of those. I like to just make one in the air fryer with my lunches every day. We got some pepper jack cheese and Munster cheese. And we got some ham. Avery was not feeling salami anymore, so she wanted ham. But my husband also got some buffalo style chicken breast for sandwiches. Uh, we got two bags of cheese. They did not have my dairy-free cheese, so I'm gonna have to get that at Walmart. We got regular cream cheese because Avery wants me to make the spaghetti that has the pasta sauce mixed with the cream cheese. And we also got whipped cream cheese for her bagels. We got four things of coconut water. I try to drink coconut water every day. My husband got the Aldi brand of Oreos. <laughs> He got this Dino and Dragon fruit snacks. You can tell that Jeremiah went shopping also with him and he probably picked these out. We got some green lentils. This is also a good source of iron and lots of fiber. Um, we just had lentils the past two nights and my husband really liked them so he wanted to get some more. He got four cans of chicken noodle soup. Um, I guess Avery said she was in the mood for soup, so she picked that out. And then my husband picked out this fall harvest vegetable soup. I do not like canned soup. I keep telling him there's so much salt in here. 
not really good for you. He also said that he wanted some chili on his hot dogs on Sunday. We got some organic peanut butter. I told my husband when we buy peanut butter to look at the ingredients and I just want peanuts and sea salt is okay, but I don't want anything with oils or added sugar or anything like that. Nothing extra, just peanuts. I've been eating an apple every day and I love apples with some good peanut butter. So yummy. We got some pickles. My kids go through some pickles like crazy. My husband got some spicy brown mustard. So my husband saw this and he just said it sounded good. So we just have to, um, I don't know, find something to put it on. Um, but it's pumpkin and butternut squash pasta sauce. I think that we got something like this from Trader Joe's a while ago and he liked it. He also got three jars of this organic tomato and basil pasta sauce. My voice is going out again. He got two bags of this um, cheese tortellini. Lexi and Avery wanna have this for dinner one night. And this is the spaghetti that he got. And he got more fruit snacks for the babies. At least these ones look a little bit better than the other ones. <laughs> Avery loves these peanut butter granola bars. And they also really like these um, chocolate fudge pop tarts. I know that they're not good for you, but um, it's just like an easy breakfast, I guess. Like when they're not really feeling eggs and bagels and whatever, they have pop tarts. And not healthy at all, but my husband hasn't bought these in a while. He got some ramen noodle soup, so we got the chicken one and the beef one. He also picked up my favorite milk chocolate butter cookies. These are so good. <laughs> Even though I shouldn't be eating them right now, they're so delicious. So I have one like whenever I'm craving chocolate. So they kind of last me for a while. He got me some maple pecan pie coffee. So we'll see if that's good, it sounds good. He got some pumpkin spice coffee, two boxes of those. And this does not sound really good to me, but he got this apple crisp coffee. Kind of interesting. I don't think that I would like it though, but that is all him. <laughs> he got hamburger buns, hot dog buns, we got two things of everything bagels. He said that he got these for me too. He thought I would like these. These are dark chocolate covered coconut almonds. It does sound yummy. He got a whole bunch of chips. He got um, these spicy dill pickle chips and sea salt and vinegar. And this is loaded bacon and cheddar flavored chips. And I'm guessing Avery picked this out. She loves white cheddar popcorn. She hasn't had that in a while. And this was definitely not on my list, but I guess he just saw it and wanted it for our bathroom. So it's a shower organizer. And he always gets sparkling water when he goes to the store. So we got blackberry lemonade, summer berry, and he got some ginger ale. I just took some honey to help my throat and I have a cough drop, so hoping we can get through this grocery haul <laughs> we got some red potatoes we got some avocados and we got some more mandarins we got some ginger i'm gonna start putting uh, more ginger like on my salads and stuff we got some carrots and cilantro I'm going to be making more salsa, so we got some tomatoes. And I'm gonna be having salad a couple times this week, so we got some spring mix. We got four cucumbers, and we got some green grapes. We got some garlic. We got red onions, bananas, a watermelon. I love watermelon. And more green apples, which is great because I have one left, and I've been eating one every day. So that is everything that we got from Aldi. So we spent $315. So um, the next clip will be everything that we got from Walmart and hopefully my voice is better by tomorrow. Hey guys, so I'm going to show you what we got from Walmart. It doesn't even look like a lot of stuff, but it was like $134 still. 
even though it's like only a few things so um but yeah my voice sounds better today thankfully <laughs> i don't know what was going on yesterday but anyways i'm going to show you what we got from walmart i love these almond flour tortillas they are gluten free and dairy free and soy free so we got two of those i started using these um for when we have tacos um because right now i am trying to eat gluten free and dairy free we got some italian style meatballs to go with the spaghetti that avery wants i got this coconut milk dairy free um yogurt I like to put blueberries in here, but I'm also, I've been in the mood for some protein shakes. So yeah, I think I'm going to make one of those for lunch today and I'm going to put this in there. I got some of this dairy-free almond coffee creamer. We got some more plant butter with olive oil. Um, I told you guys yesterday that my husband got one that has canola oil in it. So yeah, I wanted to just get this one. I like to get the one with olive oil or with avocado oil. Oh, we got some frozen peas because I like to put peas on my salad. And by the time I put them on, they kind of thaw out and they're cold. And it's like so good on salad. We got some dairy-free cheese. So like I said, we're going to have tacos one night. So I got the kids these lime taco shells. And then we also got the nacho cheese one. They like both of these. My husband likes to use these um, burrito tortillas for when we have tacos, so I got him some of those. We got some organic green tea. We got some of these extra cheesy Cheez-Its. These are the kids' favorite. I'm going to be making some salsa um, so we got some more cilantro and I like to use cilantro on my salads and my tacos. We also got some jalapenos. I got some more of my favorite organic olive oil. This is Avery's favorite seasoning and she's almost out. So I got her some more. I needed some more turmeric. So I got some organic turmeric and I got some grass fed ghee. So I use this when I'm salting vegetables or when i'm making my eggs in the morning this is really good for you and i got some coconut and vanilla native body wash for me and i got the sweet peach and nectar native body wash for the girls and that is everything that we got today so all of that was like 134 dollars that seems like so much for this little bit grocery prices are crazy but I hope you guys enjoyed my Aldi and Walmart grocery haul. Thank you so much for being here and watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.